Greg, I can't tell you how proud me and your mother are of you being a great football player, but even more proud of the man you've become and how you take care of your family and all that you do. My dad is Garth Gaines. Uh, he was a police officer for 30 years. He's a really hardworking guy. He always, you know, got us everything we ever needed it. Me and my brother, if we did anything for sports, whatever, he always made sure we had it. And, and he just instilled like good values, just the way he carried himself. Like he was a lead by example kind of guy. And that's kind of the way I am too. I'm not much of a vocal leader, but I just try and do the right thing and do what I'm supposed to do to the best of my ability. Greg growing up, he was a real go-getter, so to speak. He, he wanted to try everything. Pretty fearless kid. There wasn't much he wouldn't try, wouldn't do. Uh, and anything he set his mind to, he could accomplish, really. He, he goes off on tangents. I mean, he gets into something and tries it out for a while. And then, you know, that'll drop and something else. And, but, you know, football, he played baseball. He played football. He played soccer young. Um, so we had him in sports, we wanted to keep him busy, and he was always good. Sports for me is just something like I've always enjoyed. I like playing outside, I like doing fun stuff with friends. So I just, I really like kind of just took it and ran with it. I was always in sports. And there was a couple times like, I think baseball for me got really boring and I wanted to quit like mid season. My dad, my mom and dad would not let me. They were like, no, you signed up for the season, you're finishing it. So. And I kind of appreciate that because it kind of, you know, just in, instilled that like value of never quitting on something that you'd started, you know? He played flag football in grade school. He was playing quarterback and he, uh, so he's take, he's running the ball around the end, turning the corner and out running everybody on the field for a touchdown because he's the biggest kid on the field. So, you know, I talked to him after, you know, I go, you know, if you want to really work at football, and you want, you know, you play high school ball and you work really hard. You can get yourself a college, a, you know, a college, maybe a college scholarship to a school I, I really can't afford to send you to. <laughs> so that was a goal to, to get a scholarship. So he achieved that. He got his first uh, scholarship offer right after the end of his sophomore year. And with the 134th pick in the 2019 NFL draft, the Los Angeles Rams select Greg Gaines, defensive tackle, from Washington. Uh, tons of my friends from high school and stuff are Rams fans. Uh, my uncle and my grandfather were huge Rams fans. It was really awesome just knowing that, you know, my wife's mom could just drive over here on a weekend and hang out with the kids or like my, my grandma could just drive over, my aunt, like people come over all the time and hang out with the kids and I think that's really special, so. I, I thought it was great. I, I would have thought just about anywhere you went was great. Just getting to the NFL was great, but then it's it you know our old hometown and uh and we go there a lot it makes it a little easier to go to game that, that's great stuff what can i say i mean this year obviously was incredible you know going all the way to the super bowl my wife was there my mom my dad yeah it was cool just you know having them there and having that support he, he's a good man i think he's a good father he loves his kids he loves his family uh, he's very dedicated to them he takes care of little kids better than i did and I'm sure he's gonna be a great father. And I think he is now, he's gonna be even better. As a grandpa, my dad's, you know, he's typical, like funny grandpa. He always teases the kids and messes with them. And, but he's, he's, he's fun, you know, the kids like him. Dad, thanks for, you know, always providing everything I needed and instilling the values that I have today. Um, I really appreciate everything you did for, uh, for me and for our family.